The reverse trunk twist exercise is going to engage your core specifically through your obliques and you're also going to work on thoracic spine rotation. And your thoracic spine is the section of your spine that connects to your rib cage. So you're going to do this exercise lying on the floor, on your back with knees bent. So once you're in this position, you are going to extend your arms out to the side, keeping shoulders down away from your ears. You're going to glue those shoulders to the floor and the same with the back of your palms or the back side of your hand. You're going to engage through the core to flatten out your low back. So press your low back into the floor to raise your knees up, keeping your knees bent at about 90 degrees. You're going to rotate. You're going to drop your knees to one side, lengthening through the oblique keeping the opposite shoulder glued to the floor, and then you're going to return knees to center, squeezing through that oblique. Again, dropping knees to one side, keeping that opposite shoulder on the floor, lengthening through the oblique, and then squeezing through the oblique to bring knees to center. If you move through a range of motion that is too much for you, you will likely see that shoulder pop up off the ground and we want to prevent that. So only move through the range of motion that you can actively control by keeping those shoulder blades on, shoulders and shoulder blades on the ground. Focus on using those obliques, stretching as you drop your knees to each side and then squeezing as you return your knees back to center.